Oh wow, I repeated that phrase again. God damn it. Um, I'm gonna verify on Monday exactly how we're looking. Archers here. Actually, no. Archers up there. Let's see how they're gonna be doing from up there. Mm-hmm. That seems a good position. And everyone stand closer by one. Uh, so, the moment when I can tell you the, you know, the current situation on Perizno is on Monday when we're going to be playing Perizno. It makes sense. Oh, hello! Yeah, 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 I like that. I like that. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You boys murder that garrison. You boys murder that garrison. Why aren't you boys, uh, coming over here, for example? Hmm? What gives? There you go. That should do it. You should be able to see some enemies from here. Good. Can't just curious as you haven't seen Perizno in a hot minute and recalled you did have a lot of land last I saw. We do have around half of the world in Perizno. Um, the reason why we you didn't see any Perizno lately is because simply on Monday I could not record. I could not stream. That's all. That, that's all there is to it. I could simply not record on that day because I was away. Can Ravister Kierkegaard go mano a mano with Empire Legionnaires? Sadly, no. Sadly, no. Um, usually the Ravister Kierkegaard come equipped with axes, so their swing speed is a little bit slower, while the Legionnaires come equipped with a sword, thus a faster swing. Uh, the Legionnaires, plus Legionnaires, have uh, throwing weapons at the ready. I doubt the Kierkegaard will be able to handle their, their own. It's perfectly fine, Des. It's, it's A-OK, -okay, my man. It's A-OK. -okay. I am looking forward to kind of finishing the playthroughs, including Peri uh, including Pendor, and uh, get on with some other mods and some other playthroughs. Um, I am planning on putting some uh, Game of Thrones on YouTube. That one has been requested a bit. Not a World of Ice and Fire. We will go for a Clash of Kings. Because a World of Ice and Fire is still too fresh for right now. Hmm? They're beef here in what sense, Shadow? Please, let's discuss, my man. Let's discuss. I didn't close the subject and then say the Legionnaires win, period. Hmm? Mm, maybe I gave the wrong impression, Des. It's not that I don't like Clash of Kings. I've actually played a little bit of Clash of Kings yesterday with you guys, and I was fairly impressed. It's a beautiful looking mod. It's beautiful, it's on par with Pendor. Maybe even prettier than Pendor, I would say. I see. Okay, Shadow. You do you, man. You do you. Ouch. Um, but the reason I didn't like Clash of Kings was uh, the fact that uh, the developer took the story, took the main quest, to a weird direction, maybe a, in, even in a fan direction. I'm not sure if he corrected that now that the story has unfolded. As I said, I've played Clash of Kings maybe two years, three years ago. It's been a while. It's definitely been a while. So, um... I am willing to give it another shot, and I will judge it subjectively. Well... Object... <sighs> Yes, I guess it's going to be subjectively, because I am going to be watching it through the prism of my own mind and my own thingamajig. Uh, no, not yet, Kid and Beater. Everybody seems to be expecting that uh, Clash of Kings will be updated when uh, the series will hit the market. Not sure if that's going to be true or not. Uh, but everybody's expecting... Oh, ouch. I am doing something stupid. Why am I doing this? Cause I am an idiot, an idiot. Okay. Oh, wow, really? I cleaned up the location? That's awesome. So, this is the answer when you're facing against this type of scene. Put your archers up on that hill over there and they're gonna be able to shoot just fine. Ah, uh, no, Sprawl Ward. This is, uh... I'm not exactly sure which one. Duke Alexis, bad-tempered. 
a various loot. This is something something castle, I swear. You don't like the dev shadow? Okay. Well, it's his mod, so he can do whatever he wants with it. Uh, we actually played it on stream, Star Wars Conquest. We played a little bit of, of it on stream. And I'm willing it to give it another shot. In the near future. You know, as soon as we go through a few mods, because we're pretty... I, I have quite a backlog of mods that I need to tackle. Quite the backlog. Good. Uh, let's... I don't even know who needs... Who needs lovin'. Was it Kalendar? Might have been Kalendar. Oh, and Antonius. Definitely Antonius. Good. Nah, that's gonna make him shut up a bit. And that made Shade and Kalendar dislike me even more. Damn. Hmm? How long did it take for you to get to this stage of the game? Uh, we're on day 700 now. We're on day 700. So 700 in-game days. Oh, hours? Pfft. Holy shit, guys. Do you remember... Uh, when we started this playthrough. Oh, well, actually, it's quite easy. Um, I'm on episode 104 on YouTube, and each episode is around one hour, so 104 hours, Neo Dragon. But I've also experimented extensively and did stupid shit, so I could have done it sooner if it weren't for those meddling kids and their stupid Dashar horses. I will be grabbing these Ravensterns by the ass. It will be glorious. They will totally like it. Come on. Come on. There you go. Uh, yes. Oh, hello, James. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I do play for so long. I played so long and got so far. But the ending doesn't even matter because there's going to be a new patch coming up. So we're going to have to do another playthrough. Yes. Actually, like, I like I like Pendor very, very much, so I don't mind doing another playthrough of it. After Pendor or Perizno, I'll play some more Sword of Conquest. That is correct, Shadow. That is correct. Most likely, Des. Most likely. It all depends what we're going to be seeing. So, 414 against 425. Ooh, that's a solid mountain. Let's uh, step it up a notch. If you want a game where you got to grind your balls off, then Mountain Blade is for you. Uh, pretty much, yes. Pretty much, that is correct. Of course, there are certain mods that are shorter than others. Um, and you don't necessarily have to create your own faction each time when you conquer the world. Um, as I said... You can be simply a vassal of a faction and help them conquer the world that way, or you can um, just become help a claimant and become a permanent marshal of a faction and conquer the world that way. It's really the, the the reason I'm going for the kingdom way is simply because it's the most difficult one and uh, well and also more tedious one, and that's why. By the way, did you ever try out Medieval Conquest? I think you said you would you would sometimes like three months ago or so, but you never followed up and see if your impressions if you did try it. Uh, Medieval Conquest being a mod for uh, Mountain Blade. No, no, I didn't have the time to get around and check it out, sadly. Did not have the time to do it. Um, but I don't see why not. I'm gonna go try it out. Gonna go check it out. But again, when I have the time and if I remember, because I have the memory span of a goldfish. Hey guys, uh, you should not have come over the mountain tap. Oh boy, uh, guys, power slide. I'm gonna go stop this charge. Hey, you blokes. 
Why don't you pick on somebody your own size? Your own size, I say. Okay, that is not my size. No, 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 no. I, I'm, I'm a 38. I'm, a, I'm a size 38. Okay, stop it. God damn it. Um, hello. Forty that was a way to conquer the world with a faction and then usurp the throne without having to reconquer everything. That would be too simple. Uh, there's even a fast-paced Parisno made by Leonion, and it's called Parisno: The New Beginning. We'll probably try it out. Okay. Uh, no, the reason, the reason I made two guides in a short span of time, which I'm going to be putting on YouTube soon, don't you worry, guys. Um, or who knows, maybe by the time this, uh, this video, this episode has came out, they're already on YouTube. Whatever. Um, it's simply because I am almost finished with Pendor, and I'm almost finished with Native. That's why there were two guides. Back to back. Uh, the next one will be Perizno, and, uh, after that, hopefully, is gonna be a War Sword of Conquest, or a Clash of Kings, we'll see. Guide-wise, guide-wise. And I might need to update the A World of Ice and Fire guide soon as well. It all depends what update we're gonna be seeing this year. <sighs> Pardon? It's all right, boys. I got him for you. Mm hmm Yep. That's what we're going for right now. More enemies for the enemy gods. Everybody holds your fire a bit. So basically, person without marriage intrigues villages, and you start as a lord. Well, that sounds slightly, well, less tedious, but maybe more boring. Who knows? Maybe that's just me. I like the making your way to the top from a nobody position. Why do you always upload at 1 a.m. or 3 a.m.? Are you a night owl? What are you talking about, man? Upload at 1 a.m. or 3 a.m.? I don't. I upload when I can, and I make them public either in the evening or in the morning. You feel starting as a lord is nice for a second run or just don't got the time for the early game grind and you want to get to the meat of it. I guess so. I guess so. Oh, Ravensterns. We have the Siberia firepower. You are obsolete now. Why don't you understand this? Why don't you put your arms down? You know... That would actually make sense that sometimes the enemy armies will surrender. Hope they implement something like that in Battle Road, but I'm probably asking for too much. Probably asking for too much. I'm sorry, Shadow. Again, I have no idea what you're talking about. I always go to sleep at around... At around 1, I'm in bed. Well, whatever. It doesn't matter. Maybe maybe um, there's a get public difference between when I press the public button and when it actually goes live. I don't know. Weird, maybe. Or maybe I do upload at 3 a.m. in the morning and I just sleepwalk my way through it. Marono. Marono. I don't. I set it to the time when I click on the public button. I don't really have a schedule on when I update. It's in in the last two weeks is when I have time. 
And I kind of don't like that. Really don't like that. Uh, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm coming for you, you Ice Guard Rangers. Yeah! Take it like a goddamn man! Huh, that really didn't break their souls off too much. Mm, okay. Probably YouTube's end if you go to bed when you hit upload, assuming it's an evening upload. Oh, no, 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 no guys. No, no, no. You don't understand the process. So there is uploading the video to YouTube and then editing the video, uh, you know, adding the tags, adding the descriptions, adding the timestamps in case it's a guide, and um, adding all of these miscellaneous settings, and then uh, pressing the publish button. When you upload a video on YouTube, it goes in the private section. It goes in the private section. Those are the videos that I haven't released yet. No, I, I'm, I am on autopilot right now. I am just killing people for the sake of, you know, killing. I'm most... I'm mostly paying attention to you guys while I'm just killing on autopilot. Uh, Wookie Cade was... well, is from Australia, but he usually doesn't visit us that much, James. Mm -hmm. Yes, Thorn. Yes, sir. I actually um, brought in two new episodes this morning. That is correct. You just started a new run, and uh, Lethal Lurin is in Ravenstern, so easy arenas for awesome companions. Sure. Yeah, a lot of people do arenas to fund their enterprises and buy their companions. You know, if they're capable of taking it to the end, you do receive 2k for each arena won. And that is pretty gosh darn insane. Is it over? Holy moly. They have more. More soldiers for the soldier gods. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there were 43 kills at one point. So like a week and a half to two weeks ago, you almost played Pendor, but forgot what the min-max build, so you figured you'd wait for the new guide for the next time you get the urge. Okay. Oh yeah, I don't have any HP right now. You have no life, that's all? It's gay, James. This is a life. And I'm gonna receive- oh, hello. Good day, little fellas! How you doing? Ah, you think you're soldiers. Well, that one is a soldier, and that other one is a soldier. But the rest of you think you're soldiers. That's precious. You're precious. Slaughter them all. I do not have the patience to make men out of you. And now with Outward, that'll be a long time before you get the urge. Yeah, a lot of people have been saying that uh, they really, really like Outwards. I am breathing, yes. Yeah, because I'm the one that forces them to bear arms against me. Such an asshole I am. So ruined leveled up. There's another dude somewhere down the hill. I'm not exactly sure how everybody missed him. I've noticed that Sir Roland usually tends to st stay alive in these matters. Is that a Highlander running away? For shame. For sh <laughs> Horse charge killed him. For shame, brother. For shame. Well, didn't kill him. Knock him out. Pretty much. Yep, indeed they are, Neo. The reason I'm not doing Arena is because it is boring for a YouTube episode. Another five bite of the dust. King Gregory! Yeah, I'm a prisoner now. Count Monsieur, prisoner. Duke Aldemar, free to go. It's because you eat your vegetables in the morning. That's the only reason. Good. Abandon the rest. Grab those prisoneros. Talk to the king. And take his toothpick. Do we have space for the toothpick? We do have space for the toothpick. He 
Your friend named Carlton is trap. It's weird. I don't really understand that statement, James. What do you refer by your friend named Carlton is trap? He is he trapped somewhere? Or is he of a different gender that his name suggests? I will take it his sword in a second, my man. For right now, I need to make the Roland the best there ever was. And level up some soldiers. Okay, yeah, so the second option that I said. Well, thank you for sharing this vital piece of information that is essential to our lives. Now we know to... Yes. You've been debating making a new character on Outwards for the dumbest reason. You feel kind of defeated as you spend two hours getting to the zone for the spells and then you found out there's lightning versions for the build and you want it. It requires you to do the faction you didn't want. No clue. I can. Just gotta talk with the king first. Hello, Gregory. Hello. I am taking your weapon. Now, shoo. And we have received the dragon's tooth. Look at that pretty dragon tooth. It's a 47 cutting damage, uh, 39 piercing damage, speed rating 120, and weapon reach 130. It has a higher weapon reach than my sapphire rune sword. Uh, but, well, you can't... It's not as fast. It's not as fast. Uh, the kink already was kind of in the hate department with me, my man. It's okay. So, let's uh, see who wants that. Uh, no, 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 no. Manage my party's inventory. Given that sword. Uh, oh, wow. Okay. Put those in as well. Really? Nobody took the dragon tooth. I am... What? I think I have to manually give it to somebody. Hello, Adiz. What do you have? And the chipped dragon spine axe. 43 cutting damage. This is better. Keep it. I'd like to talk to you how to manage your equipment. Uh, upgrade as following. Keep the dragon tooth. Um, grab a shield. Grab the best bow. Grab the best arrows. That should do it. There. Hello, Matthew. Welcome back to the end, dude. No, no, no. They're just idiots. Yeah, exactly. They don't know that they can select a... If they see a two-hander, one-hander, they'll consider it a two-hander first. That's the problem. And that is the main issue of the boys. Marketplace goods. Uh, we'll have to sell a lot of stuff, but first we gotta secure the houses. The how-how-hows. There. There you go. Now let's sell the excess looty loot of lootiness. Hmm. I think somebody might have wanted that dra that uh, dragon axe, but it's fine. It's okay. We can find other dragon axes. It's perfectly fine. World burning around me, and it's perfectly fine. All right, what type of food do you have here? My favorite type of food. Cheese and sausage and everything else. Nice. Yes, it is a two hu, one hu. Also, tomorrow I'm going to be putting the new game poll for next week's Tuesday. Still got a feeling that Kenshi's going to win, though. I got a feeling. Okay, let's go to Cinderfall. And, uh, hello, what? They want Lord Gustav. Sure, grab Lord Gustav. We gotta also need to sell some prisoners.
And a soldier's leveled up. I'm down. Rangers, gear guard, wardens, man at arms. And do we stop at a raven's turn? We'll stop at a raven's turn because I would like to check out uh, their tavern and see if we can find a ransom broker in there. Where's the cable? Oh, there's the cable. It's in the air. What's RimWorld? It's winning. RimWorld is a... Hmm. Randomly generated colony management game. Um, where everything can go to shit very, very fast. I guess that's the best way of describing it. Yeah, pretty much. Clarissa of Pent. Richard, yes, exactly the person I've been looking for. That leaves me with eight lords. Eight our lords. Let's go to Cinderfall. And deal. I like the idea of Rimworld, but the models of players kind of bugs you. It's so hard for you to get into. As long as you ignore that. It is a very, very cool game. It's an evil game where a woman named Cassandra tries to kill you by sending various threats at you until you die. Huh. I guess that's one way of putting it. Questing honor, boys. Lord Shade! Let me talk with you. Talking. Social activity. Hi. Hey, I knew you liked me. Good. Keep on liking me. Basically a mash between Banished, Stardew Valley, with a sprinkle of Starcraft, all packed in a colony, with Prisoner Architect graphics. Hello, what? They want to come to Dion. Okay, it seems the Ravensterns are trying to buy all of their boys back. That will be problematic for me, but not impossible. You spoiled little boy. That's fine. It's perfectly fine. Each with their own. Each with their own. They ha there have been games out there that are incredibly, incredibly good, but I've been turned off by their old graphics or something like that. And I just couldn't watch over them. Of course, another army ravages the lands in the name of Azi Dahaka. Glorious. What do we have here? Yippers. Bring this down. Hmm. What do we got in here? Jamand. Jamond. An adventurer and a belligerent drunk. Not my cup of tea. Your day is exact opposite does. You get into 2D games extremely easily as it's really tough for you to get into the 3D games. Unless you find the art style appealing. And it's because you're people. And all people have a certain taste that they go for. It's perfectly fine. Um, I'd like to improve the quality of the Federation Guardsmen. Improve the Federation Guardsmen. Wubba bam. And now we need 640k and 337 prestige to raise their strength and agility by 2 and increase all weapon proficiencies by 20. Mon dieu. That's not going to happen. I don't think I'm going to be upgrading them any further than this. Uh, induct troops in the United Order. Wait, what? You have 17 prestige available. Uh-huh. Yeah. Not. I don't have any more. I don't have any more prestige to do this. We've turned two Empire Knights into whatever we wanted. Is there anything in this chest? No. There is nothing in the chest. Hi, Kavera. Anything? Any problems? Maybe aware, my lady, of the quarrel between Lord Sig Sigimund Stonehand and Lord Gunder Doomseeker, which is damaging the unity of this realm and sapping your authority. If you could persuade the lords to recon reconcile, uh, it would boost your own standing. However, in taking this on, you run the risk of one of the lords deciding that you have taken the rival's side. Well, as long as they're not respecting my authority, we gotta go grab them. 
I like the idea. I relish the challenge. I wonder where they're at. Boop. He is fond of me. Well, that's nice. That's very nice. Last time we saw him, he was near Laria. Well, of course he's near Laria. He's the owner of Laria. And what about the other dude, Lord Gunder? He has High Pass Fortress. We haven't seen him in a long-ass time. High Pass Fortress is where? Oh, shit. It's all the way over here. Oh, boy. Hmm. Well, I could go to High Pass Fortress. Move here, yes. We're going to go to High Pass... Uh, actually, do we go with the entirety of the army? How long do I have to, do to finish this dispute? That's going to be annoying. Hmm. Seems he does, Thorn. You won't be playing Borderlands 3 for at least six months after release as you refuse to use the Epic Launcher until there's a game you have to play ASAP because when you looked at it, you, you got turned off by it. Okay, man. Uh, a lot of people uh, seem to dislike the Epic Launcher. I've never tried it. I have no idea. Although I think I have a f the free games that they give each month. So I have those going for me. But haven't played them because I have enough stuff to play. Um, yeah, screw it. We're going to go to the south and try to find these two people. And my idea will be go to High Pass, talk to that guy. Go to... Stop it. Go to Laria, talk to that guy, and then go to Pointsbrook at attack. And on the road, we are going to be stopping near Javik's home, buying some food from there, and then keep on trucking to the south. Who knows, maybe we might find a army on the road. I reject your peace offer. I don't want your peace. I want to keep on fighting. You have Epic Privacy Browser. Is that what people are talking about? I don't think so, Archie. Gintaris! Thank you for becoming a f well. Thank you for becoming a subscriber. I almost almost went into my usual. Uh, thank you for following poetry. Thank you for subscribing with Twitch Prime, my dude. Really, really appreciate it. Hmm. What do we got here? The food. Good. Food for the food gods. Now let's go to Valen Bray. Archie, thank you for becoming a follower of my man. Welcome to Hitpoint Inn. My name is Raval. I'll be your bartender, and I really hope you enjoy your stay. Drinks are on me today. Are you the one I saw making a Pender guide earlier? Uh, yes, I am, Archie. It was, well, actually last week. <laughs> Can't wait for battles, though. Just saying. Uh, was that a hint? Was that a hint, Kintaris? Sure, man. As soon as I get my hands on Banner Life 3, I will play it. Knights of the Old Banner Life 3? Yeah. Yeah, Knights of the Old Banner Life 3. I couldn't have stated better myself. Some, oh no, no, Lord Aiden has been defeated by somebody. The horror, the horror. Morale is average now. Oh boy, that's going to be fun. It's because we have a big, big pile of... Oh, hello? Well, that's going to give me some uh, fighting. Jesus Christ, 653 yippers. Hello. Why do you want to plunder this land? What did the land do to you? It's only gr trying to grow. You had no idea they give you free games. You have it installed, but it kind of bugged you when you were searching for a new release indie game. And you had to Google to find their search. It didn't work. So you rather wait. It's fine, Des. It's fine. They're just starting off. They're just starting off. They're going to be big boys someday. Or they're going to die trying. That is also an option. 
defend that position because we like that sexual position, okay? And nobody's gonna tell us what sexual positions to use. God damn it. Hold that position as well, wink wink. Uh, yeah, everyone was quite happy with Epic Games until they started bribing game developers. No reason to argue with free games. I don't mind the part where, where they're bribing developers and stuff like that. I don't really care if I'm going to be playing it on Steam, a game on Steam or on uh, Epic Games or on the console. I don't care where as long as I am experiencing the story. Maybe that's a unpopular opinion to most. There you go, there's some killing. Everybody please move forward by one increment. I feel like we need to. Let's get rid of these boys. The fact of the matter remains that I have a, quite a few launchers on my PC now, that is correct. I have Battle.net, I have the Steam launcher, I have the Twitch launcher, I have the Uplay launcher, and, yeah, it, it, it does get a little bit annoying, that is correct. Gintaris, also thank you for following, my man. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the inn. My name's Raval, and I'll be your bartender for today, and I hope you enjoy your stay. My boys are killing faster than the script can handle. I like that. I like that a lot. Steam takes for 30%? Yeah, pretty much. Seam is the bigger boy. I... Oh yes, I also have Origins. I don't have GOG and I don't have the Bethesda launcher. Owie! That hurty. I have been knocked out. And now we shall be charging. I think. You know what? How about no? How about no? Let's not charge yet. Stay, good says. And uh, infantry and calves stay here. So that's, that's, no, no, no. Closer. 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 Yes. And calves to the side. What's GOG? Uh, good old games? Is that what it stands for? Ah, script is having a good old time. I guess. Or it's, well, technically it's a very, very good business opportunity for Epic Games, Mike. They have an exclusive right to a game. It's very good for them. Really? GOG, CD Projekt Reds? Well, I hope they're doing good. Mm-hmm. I know, I know. I know they do. I just didn't get around to it. I think I have some free games on GOG as well. Um, but hey, what's she gonna? I know. Mike, I know. It's good for the platform. Definitely not for the developers. But hey, if the, if, the, if, the, if the developer wants to go for it, that is their business. What the flying fuck are they doing? Acting weird, that's what. Okay, everybody charge. And everybody break their knees. Seems my boys kind of ran out of ammo. Uh, bring them down. Ah, new enemies have arrived. Of course they have. Of course they have arrived. Uh, we still need to go through around d -d 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 half of them. Yep, they're running around like morons. Ah. Okay. Let's, uh... Ow. Let's get back to the game. Let's get back to the nit and gritty of this world.
And I know, that's annoying, but that's how the world works, Dus. You gotta do what you gotta do. I don't know why I'm so tolerant for the shit that I receive. I guess I just know that I can't do shit about it and I just have to deal. Okay, Mike. Hey, Gabby. Welcome back to the end, dude. How you doing? Indeed. Pendor. Where things are very simple. You slash somebody and he dies. And then you move on to the other person. And he dies. Until you die. Doggy dog world. You're taking lunch? To dinner? That's horrible. Bon appetit, my man. Bon appetit. Is this the last wave? No. Oh, what am I talking about? They still have uh, 200 or two, almost 300 soldiers left. What am I speaking? No, Noldor Ranger, why? Why, Noldor Ranger? No, no, the pain, the pain. The humanity, and you're not even a human. Damn it. You're fine with PS4 exclusives mostly because the games are good, but they're never meant to be on PC. Okay. All right, Des. It's fine. What did I have for lunch? Knuckle sandwich. Nothing. Nothing. I just have a late di uh, late uh, breakfast, and that's it. The next uh, time I'm going to eat, it will be during dinner. I don't know if you guys noticed lately, but uh, during stream, I've stopped eating. Hmm. It's kind of a extreme diet, and it's it worked before I got married. No, I just can't lose weight anymore. It's weird like that. But anyway, I ate um, beef salad. I think that's the. Actually, it is boeuf. The salad is from French. That's a combination of... Uh, let me think about it. It's a combination of... Um, boiled eggs with uh, chicken meat with... Um, peas. Carrots. Um, what else? And, mayon and mayonnaise, and mayonnaise, a lot of mayonnaise, all mixed in. And that's uh, the beef salad. Interestingly enough, it doesn't have any beef in it. Ah, uh, yes, yes, I've only been married for around six months, yes. You jumped over breakfast? Oh, okay. Basically a ketogenic diet. Nah, that's just the food for today, my man. That's just the food for today. Uh, my mom. My mom uh, sent me food with myself when I came back from my hometown. So we're, we're currently going through that food. Lost 29 men in this one. Damn. Going through the boys a little bit hardcore. But who knows? Maybe we're going to find something precious in the prisoner train of this one. Technically, yes. Technically. Also, apparently boeuf is from French. That's why I did it in translator or something. 29 died, out of which uh, 6 inquisitors, 4 guardsmen, 12 legionnaires, 4 plague wardens. Ooh. What do we get? Marius loots, small patch diamonds, and nothing else. Whoa, hello, what? Never mind, a lot of other things of value, it seems. Huh. Didn't expect that one. Hello, King Carlos. Welcome back to the inn, my man. I've been trying not to eat past midnight, and man, it's hard, because that's when you, you get the more cravings. And that happens. Indeed. Well, nothing compares to the food cooked by your mom. Not necessarily a Romanian mom. Uh, yeah, thanks, Deadly Patrick. Yesterday they were 46. Almost 50. It's good. It's fine. You don't have to mention it. 
Oh, it happens. It can be either your mom or your, or your dad, as long as it is home-cooked meal. It could be your brother or your sister. Or both. It's perfectly fine. What I'm saying is, home-cooked food is delicious. Maybe they've defeated a um, unique spawn, Neo. And they just took all of the prisoners. Your KO got 380 archer skills, so almost like Noldor. Congratulations, Deadly Patrick. No, but the grand I'm, I couldn't really agree, Mike, but Grandma usually has a lot of food. Maybe not the best food, but a lot of food. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? Empire Noblemen, I'll take those. Heavy infantry, yes. Crossbowmen, yes. Armored cross, yes. Armored pike. Legionnaires, yep. Storm sisters, eh. Give me the recruits. Uh, Pendor, no. Rogue maiden scouts, Sarleon, 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 Sarleon. Fierce vein, we're gonna take all Fierce vein infantry. Light infantry, we will not take the skirmishers, we'll take the axemen, we'll take the Lady Ironhards. Just to regain some of those infantry that were missing, the dot, the dead infantry. Hello, Huskarl. Light skirmisher, I don't care. Peasant women, mm, no. Dawn wyverns will take. Pendor noble bowmen will take that. Light bowmen, no. Armored bowmen, meh. Pendor men at arms, mm. Talon of the falcon, no. I'll take the Pendor nobleman. Pendor Squire is meh. Pendor Swordsman, I'll take those. And that should be fine. There. I know, I know, I don't need them. I'm sorry, Cormac. I'm sorry. That's I always stream during your work time. I stream during a lot of people's work time, that is true. That is true. I'm sorry to hear that, Gabby. And yes, I perfectly understand what you're saying. You really need to cherish your grandparents and your parents, for that matter. Hello, Sarah. More agility for the agility Sarah God? Yeah. A weapon master for you. Am I? What am I doing with you? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. I, I guess. Sure. Weird. Don't know what I was thinking when I did that. Um, thankfully, your dad knows how to cook most of the food pretty close to your grandma before she passed years ago. I'm sorry for your loss, Dennis. What would be better or worst uh, bow plus worst arrows and 400 archer skill plus power draw 8 or best bow plus best arrows with 50 archer skill and 8 power draw? I have no idea, Deadly Patrick. Yes, it's quite unacceptable, Thorn. Have you ever tried to siege with only a knighthood order troops? Yes, I did. Deadly Patrick. Yes, I did. We've... We're, we were glorious. That's fine, Mathy. I don't really need them right now. It's not a big loss. I don't. It depends on the time zone. It, it goes through a lot of people's school hours and work days and stuff, but also a lot of people are sitting at home right now and watching. That's also a thing, hopefully. Too high pass fortress we go, brothers. Um, I think I had around 130, and we defeated a garrison of 400. It was... The battle at Silver Edge Keep. It, was, it went decently. You should be. Yes, you should be in bed. Mm -hmm. It's quite nice indeed. Oh, what, what? Sure, Half Sigla. Incur your wrath. I'm gonna show you the broad side of my ass. You can incur a wrath right there with your lips applied. I don't give a shit. And they're gonna cause problems in my territories. They're gonna be receiving the sword. Or the spear. Or the arrow. Most likely the arrow. Yeah. Mm hmm. So you can just fuck off. 
two noble legionnaires, two legion boys. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Four light, four crossbowmen. Ah, heavy infantry. Trained militia. Ah, light infantry. Axemen. Heavy axemen. Pendor noble bowmen, please. Pendor men at arms. And keep on going. Hmm? Ah, uh, no, there were actually more infantry than archers, Nidley Patrick, at the time. I think I had around... 50 archers and around 70 infantry, or 80 infantry, somewhere around that ballpark. It worked, it, we killed them pretty easily. This is the first year you have no idea what games you're looking forward to for a release. What culture am I following? Uh, Empire, you know. I'm currently following the Empire culture. And we're here. Lord Anson. wonder if he knows where Lord Sigurd Sigmund is. Hi, Anson. How you doing, baby boy? Uh, I'd like to ask you... Location of Lord Sigurd. Or Sigmund Stonehand, sorry. Currently at Laria. Okay, uh, then we're looking for somebody else. Who am I looking for? Lord Gunder. Yes, Lord Gunder. Sorry about that. Get people confused. Looking for Lord Gunder Doomseeker. Um. What? Ah, there. No, that's Gunder Iceheart. There, Gunder Doomseeker. Traveling to High Pass Fortress. He's close to High Pass Fortress at the moment. I am confused, but sure. Where are he at? Ah, oh, there he is. Get back here. I have a word to talk with you. Hello, Flavian. Bannerlord. Your friend. My friend. Our friend. What about it? By the way, if you leave as a vassal, will you keep the castle? No. You will not keep the castle, then Lee Patrick. Or your custom knighted order. <laughs> Lords have wealth thing, even a native. I really don't know. I think it's based on what the what the money and their fiefs are producing to gather up their soldiers. Not a hundred percent sure. Forgot there's a new Mortal Kombat this year. The new one is the first you have no interest in the trailer, then make it seem that good to you. Most likely. Well, all Mortal Kombat's are the same. Oh no, a different way to massively butcher somebody. Oh, well, a new lord will take ownership of the castle and they'll use your custom knighthood order. Natalie Patrick. Yep. Yeah. Want to address your quarrel with Lord Sigmund? I want you to settle them. Good. I shall speak with the boy in Laria. First, we're going to go to Singal. No, you don't have to kill your own castle, you mook. Nope. You can leave your... You can, yes, disband the garrison of your castle... Leave the the kingdom and then attack the castle and conquer it and make your own faction. That's what you could do. Deadly Patrick, my boy. Ranger. Gear guard. Ember Knight. Legionnaires. Light infantrymen. Crossbowmen. Uh, heavy infantry. Light infantry. Axemen. Heavy Axeman, Black Archer, Man at Arms. Yes, it will go away. Deadly Patrick. Of course, of course it'll go away. You're attacking their thief, my dude. That's a stupid question, my man. I swear, Deadly Patrick. Sometimes, sometimes. Enough said.
Okay. Let's go eastwards. A significant group of enemies near Elktrin. Army of enemies near Fedner. Neek spawns are going away. I don't know. I've never disbanded one of my knighthood orders. I'm trying to be... I don't know. Skulls and Bones is coming out this year. Too bad it looks fun, just not worth full price to you. And supposedly the unannounced Star Wars title is going to be a quarter four release. Okay. Sometimes. Or I make my knighthood order before I make my kingdom, but I make sure that the first castle that I'm going to be taking when I make my kingdom is my own, or the castle that contains my knighthood order. Deadly Patrick. Huh. Let's speak with the guild master. Hi, I'd like to give you some diamonds. I don't need those diamonds, but I think you might like them. They are good diamonds. Nope, don't grab the date fruit because they're going to be eaten in one sitting. Let's talk to the tavern and uh, grab a various loot from there. Hello, Ramoon. Hello, Morris. Looking for some supplies. Thank you. Ramoon, care to participate in the game of chance? No, of course you don't. Bye. Hello, Surly Bob. Welcome to the end. One day, you'll put a rightful heir on the throne. Every time you start your own kingdom. Damn. Happens all the time. Happens all the time. What do you want to tell me, Adanya? Oh, come on, Adanya. Can't you just stay a little bit more? Fuck yeah. I know you can. They're attacking Ribache. Well, since we're in the area, let's go to Ethos. Haven't been into Ethos in a long, long time. It's no longer my capital, but it still contains most of my army up in there. Also, there's a lot of red in the text bar. Lord Conrad, one of my prisoners. Some soldiers leveled up. Nice. Okay, please, Flavian, do not turn people against one another. That's not very nice. It might cause you to lose your skull yourself, good sir. Let's only be civilized, okay? Well, that escalated quickly. It determines the amount of troops that you have... And the enemy has on the field of battle. 700. Deadly Patrick. So what do we got? H Hello? Who's that? Who are you, good sir? Lord Varius. Okay. You do you, Lord Varius. Yes. Day around 700. Yo, Paradise City. Welcome back to the end, man. Haven't seen you in a long-ass time. Um. Okay, the lip Patrick, could you please calm your caps lock down? You know, this is not a race, right? Hmm, thank you, Paradise. The idea is just... I haven't talked in a while, that's all. 